Are we live? Yes, we are. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Welcome to the video. Welcome to the live stream. My name is Corey. How are you guys doing? I'll let this kick in just a little bit. Um, most likely ads will play for a lot of people right in the beginning if you're watching the, the replay too. So I'm going to just give this a second. We'll just let it load in. I'm sure there's chat. I don't see chat yet, but I'm sure it's going to load in. Um, da -da -da -da. Do -do -do -do. Do -do -do. Hey, Sasha, what's up, Sasha? You're the first person I see in the stream chat. Good morning. Good morning. Um, all right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to assume the ads kind of stop playing now. But um, anyways, good morning, guys. Aloha. How are y'all? Good morning. Good morning. It is Monday morning here in Tokyo, Japan. I am Corey and uh, welcome to the to this week's live stream. And uh, yeah. It's nice to see you guys. Okay, there we go. I'm starting to see chat now. Uh, Mike Hawk with the corn. <laughs> What's up, Mike? Uh, Jason, how you doing? Aloha, brother. How's it? Uh, Cylon, good morning. Emmanuel, Simon and Andy TV, good morning, good morning. Tammy, how are you? Oleg, good morning. From Incheon, 안녕하세요. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Yeah, so today, guys, we are going to be checking out uh, two things. It's going to be uh, one, the, the longest indoor shopping, like arcade street, like Shoten Gai. Uh, and number two, the longest outdoor one. So, indoor and outdoor. Uh, coincidentally, they actually are very close to each other. So, we're going to see both in this video. Um, oh, mom, how are you doing, mom? Guys, let's get some hearts and chat for Kijame. That's my mom. Hi. Hi, mom. Hearts and chat for mom. Uh, Cassidy, good morning. Chris, hello. Sakura Kitana, how are you? Sid Pernicious, good morning. Good morning. Liz, what's up, Liz? Uh, Jasmine, how are you? Carlitos, good morning. Uh, LA Girl Forever, what's up? Yeah, LA Girl, but from Joyzy. From freaking Joyzy. Uh, Kev the Red, how you doing? How you doing? Yeah, good morning, everybody. Amy, how are you? Linda Rosenthal, nice to see you here. Uh, Greg, what's up, Greg? How you doing, man? Uh, Tammy says, good to see you, Corey. It's been a while since I could finally catch you live. You know what? This is actually the second live um, that I've done. I did one a few days ago um, for a month, like roughly four weeks. I, I wasn't able to do anything. I wasn't able to live stream. I wasn't able to record any videos. Um, I've been recovering from COVID. Uh, so um, during this stream, if I cough and stuff and like, you know, I'm like clearing my throat and stuff, I do apologize. I still have that issue. It's just not as bad as it was like um, several weeks ago, or sorry, um, like a week ago. Like one week ago, like I could barely breathe. It would be ri like ridiculous if I was outside. Um, Generic Blue Ninja, good morning. Nancy, how are you? Ayumi, good morning. Ohayou gozaimasu. Uh, Tiffany, what's up? Says, uh, good morning from Vietnam. Thank you for the personal message. I'll send you a pic of me wearing the Moist Fam t-shirt um, and the mug when I'm back to the US. Okay, cool, yeah, thank you, thank you. Yeah, that would be great. Yeah, DM it to me on Instagram or something, on Twitter. Uh, Wasa Panin, how are you? Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yeah, let me, I'm just trying to read the chat here real quick. Cat uh, Eats Pizza, what's up? Nice name, how you doing? Uh, Putin's Daughter, okay, how you doing? Um, 3 a.m. in Italy, so weird. Yeah, welcome, welcome. It's uh, 10 a.m. Monday morning here in Japan, here in Japan, well, like nine, I think it's like 9.59 or something. It's like just before 10 a.m. Misty Davis, how are you? Good morning, Natalie. Nice to see you here. Uh, thank you, Misty. Yeah, I'm feeling much better. Obviously, you can hear me talking now clearly, uh, but there will be times where probably I'll have to like <coughs> a little bit, you know what I mean? Um, uh, Tetrarch, how are you doing? I forgot you told me what your name was in a comment. I forgot what it is, but how are you doing? Good morning. Yo, Hash, how you doing? I hope the symptoms disappear ASAP. Thank you, Chris. Yeah, um, they are improving. It's improving now. As of like four or five days ago, it's, it's on the up and up. But still, of course, I have coughing issues. Um, Sage, Gloria, how you doing? Pink Tea, nice to see you here. Victorious, what's up, what's up? Uh, Rosila, good morning, good morning. Uh, all right. Um, so before we start the stream, guys, as, as always with my live streams, 
Um, if I miss the chat, like uh, you guys coming in, coming, uh, leaving and stuff, saying hi and bye, asking questions and whatnot, and I miss it, I do apologize in advance. Sometimes chat goes by so fast and uh, I just can't see it or something like that because of the bright sun. But yeah, so just hang tight. Um, if I miss something, just re-ask, but don't spam. Um, as we walk around, sometimes the signal might buffer a little bit. Um, I've never streamed down here, so I don't know if the signal strength is going to be kind of strong or weak in certain spots. But uh, yeah, so just hang tight on that. I hope you guys have drinks and snacks. Um, click the little cogwheel on the video, change this to 1080p. That way you can see it in the highest resolution possible. And um, what else? Yeah, we're going to be looking for cats and dogs if possible. I've got some cat treats. Uh, D, good morning, Scarecrow, how are you? Yeah, so anyways, so let me turn this around and I'll uh, tell you guys uh, more about where we're uh, at. Yeah, we good? There we go. Good morning, guys. Good morning, good morning. Welcome to the live stream. We're walking down this street here. If I uh, zoom down, there you can see it leads to a covered Like way down there, there's a covered uh, shopping arcade street. That is the Musashi Koyama Palm. So we're, we're now in Musashi Koyama. Yeah, Musashi Koyama. This is like Southern Tokyo area. Uh, Bar Levon, how you doing? Michael Stern, what's up? Yeah, what is this? Earth golf. Is this indoor golf? Like screen golf? I guess, yeah. So it's Monday morning. Um, it was a very long commute down here from Matsudo. It was like an hour and 10 minutes, hour, 15 minutes, plus transfer time and stuff. And uh, is this a yakitori place? I think so. It's just, it looks really grungy. It's probably got some really good yakitori though. Sherry, good morning. Book lover, ohayou gozaimasu. It's golf for people on Earth. Duh. Yeah, no aliens allowed. Jeez. Yeah, so um, the, I'm in Musashi Koyama. It's like uh, several stops away from Shibuya and Meguro. We're like we're south of Shibuya and Meguro. And that's basically where we're going to kind of be at. Um, we're going to go through this place, the covered mall. And then we're going to walk right over to Togoshi Ginza, which is uh, the longest outdoor shopping street. So. Yeah, as we go through it, um, I'll just kind of like look at stuff randomly. You know how it goes with these live streams. I sound so much better. Um, I, <coughs> excuse me, when I, <coughs> excuse me. Yeah, my, my voice is okay. Voice, voice is fine. Thank you. Uh, it's my lungs, my lungs, my respiratory tract. It's, uh, it's still on the up and up. Not 100% yet. John, how are you? <coughs> how you doing? It's the accumulated juices of ten, uh, thousands of chickens. Yes, we love, we love the cock juice. Um, <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Did you jinx it? Uh, no, it's, it's, it's like one of those things where like, if you think about it, then it, you start to like focus on it, you know? I'm like, do I have to cough? And then I think about it and I'm like, oh, I feel a tickle in my my lungs and then i'm like wait i do have to cough <laughs> yeah so don't worry you didn't jinx it i jinxed myself but i hope everyone's doing well um yeah we're i don't know how long this is going to be i'm just going to go through the shopping streets um in musashi koyama and then togoshi ginza afterwards and then that's about it and then i'm going to head head back home uh pixel with the 11 euros guys hearts and chat for pixel thank you arigatou gozaimasu Thank you, thank you, thank you. <clears throat> yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll try not to cough in the mic and like blow out your eardrums. I'll like turn my head to the right. But uh, what is this? There's a little coffee place. A little dog. I like that. It's like a maestro. <laughs> yeah, so this area, uh, Musashi Koyama, it's kind of a nice neighborhood. Um, very residential, lots of apartments and homes and stuff. A lot of families out here. I don't know how much rent is though in this area. Um, I think it could be a little bit on the higher end just because of the location. 
What is this? High ball. Oh, this is a. It's like a bar. This is their menu. They wrote their menu on the glass. Yeah, logo of the dog. Yeah, it needs to be a real dog or a real cat. But right here, this is the entrance uh, to one of the wings of uh, Musashi Koyama's palm. So palm, I don't know why they call it P-A-L-M, palm. That is the name of this uh, covered shopping street. And this is the longest covered shopping street in Tokyo. It's uh, like 800 meters long. There's like 250 different shops in and around here. And uh, Musashi Koyama is like very famous for lots of different festivals, lots of different matsuri. So like throughout the year, um, you know, minus the pandemic and stuff, they would always have like different like parades and matsuri stuff going on around here. So yeah, pretty popular. Caitlin, how you doing? Good morning. Yeah, hopefully the signal hangs tight while we're underneath the cover. Um, these covered roof things, they actually retract. They can open up so you can like get some sunshine or fresh air. But yeah, this, this specific wing, this one right here is it's, it's very old. It's got definitely like old Showa era vibes. Like this coin laundry sign is just looking pretty old here. Yeah, and at 10 a.m. Um, Monday morning, like there's not so many businesses open yet. Uh, some will open at like 11 or t 12. Um, some might be even just completely closed today. Yo, back in the clay, how you doing? Woo, you made it. Loving the fonts. Yeah, I love signage. Signage and font face, like type, typeface, like that kind of stuff always interests me. But the Showa era, yeah, the, the older vibes, yeah, the, the, the font faces from that kind of era, like, is just really, really interesting. But, yeah, in, in these types of shoten guys, uh, you're going to find all your, like, daily goods and stuff. You know, the barber shop, the cleaning, um, the dry cleaners, uh, local pharmacy. Uh, speaking of pharmacy, there's one right here. Yeah, lots of little, like bars and stuff. Uh, looks like this is a place where people can stand. It's like a standing window and they'll serve like, I don't know, maybe yakitori or something. They're closed right now. Um, let me see. Jason says pre-dinner snack, crispy chicken strips and Diego hot sauce. Not a sponsor, but could be. Ooh, that sounds good. Greg says, Corey, I'll be in Tokyo in 89 days. Do you suggest that I leave the Moist family shirt here in the States or bring it to Japan? Oh, that's, that's up to you. Wear, wear, you don't have to, <laughs> you can wear whatever you want or you can wear nothing at all. Like, that's, that's your choice. <laughs> you don't have to ask me. What is this? Hair salon kahie. I thought this was saying cashier, but I think it's supposed to be like kahie or something like that. Or old, old local uh, bakery, bread shop right here. Uh, Silence says, can you buy the good stuff in pharmacies there without a prescription? Probably not. Um, yeah, oh, I see, uh, I see a dog. There's a black Shiba Inu coming this way. Uh, we've got a, an old store here that sells like kimono fabrics and stuff. A lot of kimono stuff here. Look at this chonker. Hey, chonky boy. <laughs> hi, hi. <laughs> Inu count one. Yeah, he was a chonky boy. Um, summer sunshine, good morning. Good morning. Yeah, so it's nice to see these kinds of businesses. This is just like straight up, like probably family owned. It's probably been here for generations. Uh, oh, there's a pachinko parlor right here. Linebacker dog? Yeah, that dog was wide. Oh, let me cross. 
cross. The light is turning red. Uh, <clears throat> here's a little handsome Inu, right? Hey Goya, how you doing? From SoCal, nice. Uh, here's a vending machine, sells ramen. Frozen ramen and you just take it home. There's ice cream. Ooh, what do we got here? We've got chocolate, mul uh, milk with multicolored chocolate, macadamia, fr strawberry, cookies and cream, raisin butter crunch, uh, chocolate cookie crunch, tiramisu with ganache. Looks really good. Here's matcha, some just flavorful green tea. Uh, you feeling better today? Yes, Summer. Yeah, I, feel, uh, I still have a, a cough, but um, yeah, much, much better compared to last week. Caramel vanilla, vanilla, blueberry cheesecake. Ooh, Satsuma Mandarin. Ooh, wow, that looks good. It's like a little squish push pop thing. Uh, we've got a Monaka. This one's got milk, cream, and uh, azuki red beans. There's a grape uh, sherbet. Soda vanilla, and the best flavor in the world, guys, choco mint. Choco mint. Hearts and chat for Choco Mint. Oh, is there an event? Original tent present. You could potentially win a Choco Mint tent. That's cool. I want a Choco Mint tent. Yeah, there's a lot of vending machines here. We'll, we'll pick up a drink like kind of halfway down as we go through here. Uh, looks like a nice old Chinese restaurant here. We've got all the plastic food on display. That looks really good. Yeah, I noticed there's a big red dragon up top. That's pretty cool. Yeah, more ramen, skemen type of shops around here. Uh, this place is always good. If you're here by yourself and you want to eat yakiniku, like grilled meat, you, it, you can eat by yourself here. You have your own personal table. Let's see, Olivia, how you doing? Asking, uh, any tour videos coming soon? I don't have anything like recorded yet. Um, if you didn't know, uh, I, I caught COVID like at the end of April and um, I've been clear of COVID since, you know, like April 29th. That's when I like finally tested negative. But uh, I've been dealing with respiratory issues ever since. So for like three weeks, yeah, just like breathing issues, coughing and stuff. So um, it's been kind of difficult for me to like go out. I like this old pattern right here. Uh, Nagai, how you doing? Long time no see, oisashiburi. Reminds you of Sasebo? Yeah, this does kind of look like Sun Plaza, right? I mean, yeah, a lot of the Shoten guys like this, they, they have the covered roof and stuff. Yeah, it, definitely reminiscent of Sasebo. So as I come out over here to the left, uh, this is Musashi Koyama Station. Let me just kind of show you quickly. Silence says, I'll eat by myself anywhere, Corey. Yeah, me too. Me too. Yeah, so this is uh, the station. Station entrance is over here. Goes down, this will take you into Shibuya and Meguro and stuff like that. Uh, there's a department store here. There's this big um, kind of mall building right here. This was uh, opened in like 2020, I think. Um, when I arrived in 2019, I remember it was still under construction. Huge apartment building. And there's some shops and stuff like in the first floor. There's a Starbucks like right over here. Uh, hi, Kristin, how are you? It says, uh, how is healthcare in Japan? Uh, we have a uh, national healthcare, like universal healthcare. So yeah, it's really good. Um, going to the doctors and getting x-rays and medicine like you're, you're gonna spend like 30 40 dollars tops for like a, norm, a normal visit including x-rays and stuff and blood tests 
and prescription medicines. It's really cheap. Thank God for Universal Healthcare. Yeah, so um, coming back, so if we look this way, we, uh, we came from that direction. So we, we're coming this way, and now we're gonna go down this way. This is the longest wing of Palm. So many Uber Eats delivery right now? Yeah, I think um, Uber Eats really kind of blew up because of the pandemic. Um, let me zoom in down, down this way. Yeah, sorry for the shakiness. I can see a gold dragon down there. It's kind of cool. Damn, D stew, that sucks. But I totally feel you, yeah. You know, I used to live in America and it, it would be like hundreds of dollars just for like a normal doctor visit or an ER visit or something. Uh, oh, we found one of this, uh, the real estate chains. Do you guys remember this? Ball eggs. Ball eggs, you remember that? We, we haven't seen a ball eggs in a long time. Yeah, so um, this strip here, the very longer, the longest strip of palm is uh, more modern. It's like more developed. Yeah, it's like, a, what is it? It's 1020, roughly. 1020 and uh, yeah, these are just like normal people coming out, doing their like morning shopping. Hey Puff, good morning. Jason says, I've only used Uber Eats once and that was to order fried chicken while I stood in line at Best Buy overnight to buy Xbox Series X. That's actually a very nice way to use it. Yeah, they still have some old stuff here. There's an old uh, bookstore. Tama Books. Books Tama. That's pretty cool. Older books. Um, a lot of pachinko around here. More pachinko right there. There's a big daiso on my left. Was it Kame Ari that had the ball eggs? Yeah. Oh, cut in you. That that one was funny. The the barber shop. Yeah, there's a a decently large daiso here. It looks like it's uh, got several floors. I see an escalator inside. But interesting, you can see all the bicycle parking. Everyone's parking. Uh, C. Archer is asking, are, uh, are you using a camera phone stabilizer? Yes, absolutely. I, uh, I always use stabilizers for everything since forever, uh, seven, eight years ago. Looks like Times Square. Um, I don't know, I've never been to Times Square, but yeah, this is pretty cool with the gold dragon. D. Stu says, I would love to visit Japan. It seems like such a fun, peaceful place and the people very respectful. Yeah, yeah, you should definitely, uh, I definitely recommend people to come to uh, Japan at least once in their life. Um, it's a culture and place worth visiting. Here's a mode off. It's kind of like discount store, secondhand goods and stuff. There's a whole chain, book off, um, hard off, yeah, mode off. They uh, you know, have books, games, furniture, like all kinds of stuff. There's a, do a cat cafe. Dog and cat. Pet shop. Oh, it's a pet shop plus cat cafe. Okay. Uh, you can type exclamation masks in the, in the chat. Uh, Costa's World of Music Memories, Jim and Harriet with a $5 dono, says, hello, Corey, everyone, keep it moist. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, we gotta keep it moist. We gotta get a drink soon. Farouk, good morning. Yeah, let me just, I'm just kind of looking in, taking in the vibes, showing you guys uh, what it looks like right now in Tokyo on a Monday morning. Um, this is a pharmacy in front of me. What is she at? There's 
another pet shop. Peas first for cats. Yeah, these uh, these covered shopping streets. You know, they they do have like cars that actually drive through here. So this is, as you can see, a, a place where it crosses through. Where's the video game shop? I don't know. That's a good question. I, uh, this is so far from my house, I never come here. I've been here before a few times, but I, I, I never like come here normally. Uh, they do have arcades. So we've got uh, the claw machine stuff. There's a green dragon here. Hey Cranberry, how you doing? Hope, uh, hope I f uh, I'm feeling better. Yeah, I'm feeling definitely better than last week. I still have a, a bit of a cough every now and then. So I just have to take it easy. That's why I'm kind of walking like slow right now. Uh, this is uh, Ietomi. It's a stationery store. This is magnet hook clips. Sticky hook pocket. Oh, okay. It's like it can hook stuff and hold pens or scissors or whatever. I like the cat ones. Shiba Inu. Uh, Don, how are you? It says, hey, Corey, go to Hakata. We'll be waiting for you here. Oh, in, in Fukuoka? I don't know when, like, when I'll go to Fukuoka next. Um, it's going to be a while. I need money <laughs> to do that. Uh, Emmanuel asks, those closed streets are heated or are they hot in the summer? Yeah, so it's, it's still like, there's no like, uh, how can I say? It's open air, but the, the, there's a covering on the top here. So like on the sides and stuff, there's, you know, streets and alleys. It just goes right out. So there's like, you know, if I walk this way, it just goes right out. Like, so in the winter, it can be cold. Um, they don't heat this place up. It's yeah, not going to work. <laughs> yeah, I love these arcades. These are really cool. Uh, B. Petty, how are you? There is a liquor off near there. Oh, really? I've actually never seen a liquor off. They don't have any near uh, where I live. Uh, Kristen says, is YouTube your full-time job? It should be. Love your videos. I wish. Uh, it, it pays. Uh, it doesn't pay well enough to be my full-time job. So I do work also. I'm just not like some of those cool people that, you know, can become a full-time YouTuber. Um, I think the other part of it is uh, to live here, you need a visa as a non-Japanese person. So, gotta work. Gotta work to pay the bills. Um, Puff says, okay, I got a cup of coffee and I'm ready for Relaxy Stream. Yay, Relaxy Stream. Uh, here's a slightly kind of off gold color dragon so we saw what red green and yellow and now this is gold gold dragon LB good morning how are you uh, Jason says speaking of money best way to send uh, oh he's talking about PayPal yeah thank you for that there's another piece first there's a lot of pet stores here Uh, looks like a daily electronic appliance type of store. They've got uh, the AC wall units here, fans. They have all this stuff out front now because it's, uh, it's starting to get hot. It was like 33, 32, 33 degrees Celsius the other day. It was so hot. Um, luckily, rainy season is coming soon, so that's going to keep things cool for a little bit. But then uh, once rainy season is over, it's going to be just like hell basically. Got some old washing machines here. Yeah, it looks like these are all re um, used. So secondhand. Yeah, it's like 39,000 or well, with tax, 43,000. Uh, I'm trying to face this way because there's a bunch of kids passing by behind me. It's uh, one of those preschools, so I don't want to show their face. 
Oh god, I broke it. <laughs> yeah, it's a double thing. Five kilogram air intake. Yeah, that is 41,000 yen. Yeah, can you see the group of kids there? At least from here, we can just see their backs, like the back of their face, like we don't see their face. Um, what is this? Oh, it's some kind of children's thing here. They've got a, some deer. Yeah, 33 Celsius is nothing. Um, I mean, it's hot, but like Japan, like back in August and stuff, it gets up to like 40, 41, 42 degrees Celsius. And with the heat index, it's like 44, 45, 46. That's like, uh, like 117 degrees Fahrenheit, like in Japan <laughs> in August. It's just absolutely miserable. Uh, Kristen, welcome to the Moist Fam. Guys, hearts and chat for Kristen. She just became a Moist Fam member. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, enjoy the little icon next to your name, uh, which will change over time, the longer you stay a member and uh, enjoy access to the emotes and stuff and whatnot. Uh, Arwen, how are you doing? Says, uh, how's the humidity compared to the States? Uh, in the summer, it's ridiculous. Um, you know, people are like, oh, you know, I lived in the South. I lived in Florida and Georgia, like, you know, Maryland or whatever. Like, I can deal with humidity. You trust me, it's different. Um, one of our moderators, Donby, she, uh, she's from Florida. She said the same thing. And then she came here, she lives in Japan. Um, and she was like, what, what, in, what in the F is this humidity? It's way worse than Florida. Yeah, like I, I, I don't, I'm trying to think of a country that's as humid as Japan in the summers. And the only place I can think of is maybe Singapore, maybe Taiwan. Um, in the summer, those places are absolutely muggy, like just so humid. The air is so heavy and thick, way worse than America. Uh, there's some nice traditional Japanese mochi snacks and stuff. That looks kind of good. Ooh. Uh, H. Welch says, uh, yay, hope you're feeling better. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I feel better, um, but I still have a little bit of a cough. So if I cough during the stream, I'm so sorry, guys. And in there. Hello, hello. We okay, chat? Is it still buffering? Sixty nine ball eggs, my friends. Sixty nine ball eggs. Sixty nine ball eggs, if you can hear me. We back 69 ball eggs if you can hear me. Anita McAllister with the $10 super sticker. Guys, hearts and chat for Anita. Thank you so much. Arigato gozaimasu. Arigato. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, it looks like we hit a dead spot for the reception down here. It's not as strong as it was like towards the front. Thailand is humid. Yeah, I've been to Thailand in the summer. Um, it's not as humid as Japan's summer. <laughs> I lived in Vietnam for two years. It does get hot there, but it's still, the, the humidity is not as bad as Japan. Yeah, I see a, I see a blue, like a black and blue dragon down there. Okay, we good? Yeah, it looks like we're back. Yeah, so it's pretty nice. Um, down some of the side streets and stuff, there's more businesses like restaurants and you know whatnot. But uh, we're just sticking to the main Shotengai, the covered Shotengai here. There's a bike shop. That's what that sound is. People are filling up the, their tires.
There must be so many different smells. Actually, no, it's not, it's not like a very aromatic, like pungent market, like, uh, like some wet markets and stuff in Asia, like, the, the, like in Korea and whatnot, like you'll, you'll get some really pungent places uh, here. Really no smell at all. Um, unless you walk by like a bakery or something, you'll smell the bread. Yeah, so we're, we're kind of coming to the end right here. This is the end. Um, let me turn around and just kind of look back this way. Yeah, um, let me zoom in. Yeah, there's, a, there's the blue dragon. It's very long, huh? This is uh, Tokyo's longest indoor shopping street. Palm in Musashi Koyama. Why is my phone shaking so much? It's stabilized, but the video itself is like shaking. That's weird. I don't know if that's like a firmware thing. Because my, my phone and the, everything is completely stabilized. I think it's a firmware issue. Yeah, crying child. Eh, wee. Um, so as we come out here, I'm gonna show you the, the outside looking that way. And then uh, we should get a drink and then walk over to Togoshi Ginza. It's in walking distance. Yep, so it says Palm. P-A-M, Musashi Koyama Palm. Yeah, why is it? That's weird that it's shaking. It didn't used to do that. Anyways, it's a, it's a nice day. You can see there's a blue skies and some clouds. It's kind of hot. It's like 26 degrees, 27 degrees. It's a little bit humid. But we're going to head this way. Um, as we go east from this shopping street, we'll come across uh, the Togoshi Ginza. It's like not far at all. It's like a few city blocks away. Yeah, I've never seen it shake like this either, Puff. I think it's, it's got to be some kind of software thing because my phone and the stabilizer are like completely steady. I am not, even if I was shaking, the, um, the stabilizer and everything will do it. Uh, hold on, let me see if there's like a shake thing on my app. Yeah, I don't see I don't see any option for like uh, in in app stabilization. But yeah, we're gonna go this way, a little bit north. Palm was huge. Thanks. Yeah, you're welcome. Um, so largest indoor shopping street in Musashi Koyama called Palm. We're gonna be walking to the largest outdoor shopping street. It's even longer. It's called uh, Togoshi Ginza. And uh, I think it's like 1.3 kilometers. Yeah, it's like 1,300 meters. 1 1.3 kilometers. I think it's like 4,000 something feet. I think it's like almost a, a full mile. Hey JT, how are you doing? Uh, wow, what is this? There's an old Citroen car. Citroen. I don't know what model that is. That looks pretty cool. It's just chilling in the shop. Looks like they're working on the engine. That's oh, kind of hard to see. Eh. Oh wow, they've got a... is that a Jag? Yeah. Zoom in and then out. Maybe it's the zoom. I think it, it's like specific is this one still shaking too? Hold on one second. I'm checking the settings. Yeah, there's... There's no option for like stabilizing. I don't know why it's shaking like this. This is really weird. I am so sorry guys. I'll just have to continue. Yeah, that's... it's... I don't know what this is. I'll, uh, I'll contact the app. They just recently updated the, the software, like a few days ago. It might be something from there. 
I'll tell them, like, everything was steady and now it's not steady. Why? <laughs> Oh yeah, just hang tight. I'll, I'll try to... I'm, I'm holding my stabilizer as steady as possible, as always. It should be okay, but uh, yeah, it's weird. Maybe swap from one camera to another. So yeah, usually when I do that... Um, I'm holding perfectly still. I can, it looks like it's shaking a little bit. Yeah, that's definitely noticeable. Yeah, I don't know what that is. I'm going to I'm going to try to figure that out later. I'm sorry. Uh, let's try to get a, uh, a drink, y'all. Let's get a drink. Um, we've got green tea. We've got uh, just other tea, lemon squash, Deca Vita C vitamin drinks. Here's a grapefruit, uh, vitamin, oh no, is it not grapefruit? Is it grapefruit? Anyways, um, flavored water, no thank you. Uh, we've got natural mineral water, Pepsi, no thank you. Uh, we've got apple juice, uh, vitamins, this looks like oranges and apples, uh, strawberry milk, unfortunately I cannot drink that. Um, lychee and yogurt flavored something. Uh, Mm. Oh, it's got salt in it too. Okay. Uh, Momo mix. We had this last time. This is actually pretty good. It's like a, a slightly fizzy CC lemon drink, but it tastes like peach juice. It's pretty good. Um, energy drinks, caffeine, caffeine. There's a coffee, 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 coffee. Uh, we've got more stuff up here. Tea and water. There's a sports drink. Yeah, barley tea. Uh, is it oolong tea next to the green tea? Oh, back here. No, this is a. It's a mugi cha. Yeah, this is a mugi cha here. Iced tea, lemon tea, double lemon. I don't know what that is. Uh, Donby, how you doing? No worries. No worries. No worries. We're still going. Um, tea, apple juice, sparkling orange juice. Sounds actually kind of good. Red Bull. Uh, what is this? Some kind of melon soda? No, thank you. Bickle. Um, I don't see Bickle. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Bickle. Yeah, Bickle is the strawberry ole. This, is ha this has milk in it. I can't drink that. And then a uh, coffee. And then a mini Pokari sweat. So, yeah. What should I drink? I think the selections here are pretty decent. Water is the best as per doctor. <laughs> that is true, that is true. Should I get a tea? I'm kind of curious about this uh, sparkling orange juice or the apple juice. Yeah, so maybe I'll, I'll get tea plus like one of these. Which one should I get? Should I get a press one for apple or two for sparkling orange? One for apple, two for sparkling orange. Type it in the chat. One for apple, two for sparkling orange. Which of these should I get? I'll get tea also. Drink the tears of my enemies. Nice, I should. Damn, I see a lot of twos. I see, it. oh my, it's like overwhelmingly a two. Three milk, no, I'm gonna shit myself. <laughs> Cold tea, yeah, I, I definitely will get a tea. I, do, I will get a tea. Uh, one and two. Oh, wow. Interesting. Melon. God damn it, Sasha. <laughs> um, okay, it looks like two. Two is the winner. I, it's like overwhelmingly a two. All right, let's go. Let me, uh, how much is that? 140 in. Okay, let's uh, put my coins in here. I have a lot of 10 yen coins. Like that. One, two. Three, four. Are we good? Make two great again? Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Ta-da. 
Okay, so we've got the sparkling orange by Pom. Pom is a very famous orange juice company here in Japan. Um, as for tea, I think I want barley tea. Um, they're both the same price. They're both 600 milliliters. So I guess I'll just get it from here. So one second, let me uh, get more coins. Yeah, barley tea is really good, guys. When it's really cold, it's like perfect for um, like hot summer days. I put in 150. Get our change back. Where's the mountain do? Uh, probably in a different machine, not, not this one. Yeah, there we go. Some barley tea. So yeah, this is uh, this blue one is by uh, Suntory. Boss Coffee. And then this white one is run by uh, po uh, Poka Sapporo. So it's two different companies vending machines. I don't know which one has the Mountain Dew. Is it the Coca-Cola one? All right, let me... Uh... Yeah, so I'm walking down the street. Do you see this sidewalk right here? Uh, sorry, this crosswalk. We're going to cross and this is going to take us right to Togoshi Ginza. There's like that side street right over there. That right there. That is the, the entrance to Togoshi Ginza. So that's how close it is from the other shopping street. But before we uh, go fully down this thing, look at this. Let me zoom in. Sorry for the shakiness. Yeah, that shakiness is really bad. But you can see all the way down there, it's the longest outdoor shopping street in Japan. Or sorry, in, in Tokyo and also in the Kanto area. Sorry, not Japan, not Japan. Just Tokyo. Mountain Dew is Pepsi Cola owned? Okay. That's kind of what I thought. So let me find a, a little ledge or something to like prop up, prop you guys up. Maybe right here? It's kind of tilted. It's a little tilted, but I think it'll be okay. Okay, sorry about that. Hey, I am Moist Family. If you guys are looking for some uh, Moist Fam merchandise, check out my uh, moist fam shirts up on on the youtube you can type in merch exclamation merch in the chat and uh it should give you a link to the store we've got an inu and neko count one too a dog cat a dog count cat count shirt um i'm still waiting for mine to arrive <laughs> uh one second thanks jason let me put this in here I just want to wet my lips, wet my whistle uh, with some of this sparkling orange. Let me see if you can hear the sound of it. Oh, okay. There we go. Yeah. Nice. Ah, it smells like delicious orange juice. Like really, you know how when you can like tell some orange juice is like just really good? There's some really shitty orange juice out there. This is like good. It smells good. All right. Cheers, guys. Ooh, it's like slightly carbonated. This contains 30% real orange juice. It's probably why it smells really good. Ah, and tastes really good. Uh, Pop says, my Inu and Neko shirt shipped like same day. Nice, yeah. Really, 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 really refreshing and tasty. Am I feeling better? Yeah, so as you can hear, like uh, I'm I basically sound normal. Um, once in a while, I'll, I'll cough or something, um, but not too bad, not too bad. Uh, I think there's one other thing that I notice is um, like when I go upstairs and stuff, I still feel really winded. Um, so my energy levels are like not the same. I'm still 
you know, I've been at home for like a month basically. So I'm still like getting used to being out and about walking and whatnot. This camera view doesn't j jiggle. Yeah, let me, let's do a test. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna point this the other way and we'll see if it jiggles and I'm not even gonna touch it. Yeah, so this is the zoom in mode. Let me um, see if I can zoom in down the street. Yeah, so I'm not touching it right now. It's pretty steady. I think it's like if you if you move it just a little bit. Yeah, see it's like starting to shake. I think it's like overcompensating. Their software is probably overcompensating for something and it's just not jiving well. Uh, let me try the other camera. Other lens, here we go. Yeah, how's that? I'm not touching it. Is it okay? Let me shake it just a little bit. Yeah, all right. Well, it is what it is. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look into it, guys. I'll try to like contact the, the company or something and be like, yo, what's going on? Like something's, something's up. It's not the stabilizer. It's the, it's the phone app that I'm using. To, I'm using a Prism to stream. I think it's Prism. They updated a few days ago. This, this is a new issue. Yeah, it's their software. It's a software issue. Whoa. Anyways, new stabilizer. Uh, I've had this for a while now. Um, I don't know when I got it. I got it sometime like early last year. Yeah, but I'm looking forward to showing you guys um, down the street here. Yeah, it's gonna be pretty cool when we walk down there. Um, what can I? What else can I tell you about this place? Um, yeah, there's like uh, oh, there's some. Um, a mascot. There's a street cat mascot. To Togoshi Gin Gintan? I think its name is Gintan. It's a cat. I think I think it can, I can see it shaking a little bit. I'm not even touching it. Yeah, what's going on? I don't know what's going on. Ah, that's really good. Give me facts. Sorry about that noise. <clears throat> what does a Ginza mean? So any kind of Ginza is like a like a shopping area. So like Yanaka Ginza, Togoshi Ginza, um, actual Ginza in Tokyo. They're all just like different little shopping areas um, <clears throat> where you just do shopping, basically. Uh, let me turn this around. Let's get going. Yeah, we good chat? Okay, there we go, sorry. Uh, oh, Donby, thank you for that. Yeah, I should have like a, a, a what do you call it? Like a, like a quick backstory that people can just type in like the exclamation mark to pull it up. Be like, why is Corey in Japan? What, what, what's his deal? Why does he speak English? Like, what the fuck? There we go. Is it dark? Sorry, so what the hell's happening? We okay, chat? All right, there we go. Uh, we're having we're having slight technical issues today. I'm sorry. <clears throat> yeah, I, I gotta make them. I gotta make some prompts for that. Ginza meant where rich people go. <laughs> It could be. I mean, Yanaka Ginza is not like a place where rich people go. The same with here, Togoshi Ginza. It's just a normal shopping street. Oh, excuse me, I have hiccups. Shopping street. 
Yeah. So, but they said, um, from what I've read, there's a uh, like 400 different like stores in and around this area. You can see it's all open air right now. Technological, yes, exactly. Yeah, they have. Uh, so they have these poles. Oh, here's the mascot. This is the cat that I was talking about. And he has like a star shape on his head. I guess if, if you rub it, you're supposed to get good luck. Um, but yeah, Togoshi Ginza. And um, at the top, they have, it's kind of hard to see from this angle. Yeah, they have the lights and then there's like a CCTV camera and then there's a speaker. And so a lot of like, all of them have speakers and they're like playing some pretty chill music. It does kind of sound like, um, uh, Disney, but it's not. I just got an earthquake alert. Oh. Four. Okay, Kozushima earthquake. Sorry. I was like, where is that earthquake? Was it here? He's high on pills. Yeah, his eyes are like tweaked out. Uh, what is this? This place is called Grandma. The spicy curry. Yeah, so just like the other Shoten guys everywhere, you know, we've got the dent, the local dentist office is right here. Um, barber shop is closed. Uh, there's a Yamato uh, Kuroneko delivery service here. Yeah, it's just all your like daily needs, daily good shopping. Uh, Dombi says, what is the best cheese you've had in Japan and where did you get it? Um, I usually buy cheese from Seijo department, uh, supermarket. Seijo has a pretty good cheese selection. Um, I forget what I had, but um, it was imported from Europe. Was it from Sweden? I can't, or, uh, I can't remember where it was from. Oh, look, here's the cat. Here's one of the cats. Gintan. Yeah, so you can see he's holding a ball. I don't know what he's holding a ball for, but you can come here and it looks like you can get some uh, paper thing here and we can do like a stamp. Let's see what this is. There's a stamp. Japanese love collecting stamps of different things. It looks like green ink. Get it in there, press it hard. Ah, nice. <coughs> Whoa, excuse me. S sudden sneeze. Yeah, so we've got here a little stamped guy of Ginchan. Yeah, and then he's got the star on his head. You're supposed to like rub it for good luck. <laughs> rub his lucky spot. It's not his crotch. I'm gonna tell you right now, it's not his crotch. Yep, there we go. Nice earth. I keep getting the earthquake alarm. Why? Not alarm, but like uh, notifications. Yeah, we're okay, guys. We're okay. Uh, there's a nice coffee roasters here. I can smell it. it smells really good. Uh, what is this? Grill and galette. Galette. B mixed up. What is this supposed to mean? They do lunch and dinner here. What B mixed up? What is that? What is that supposed to mean, guys? <laughs> I don't understand. I don't understand. Should put that on a t-shirt. Looks like uh, there's a pizza place for Maggio. They don't know. <laughs> Nobody knows. Got a lot of bicycles passing through here. I see some, there are some motorcycles. Here's more of the Gintan. Uh, yeah, they're doing some kind of safety, safety thing here about fire. They're going to teach the neighborhood, like if there's a fire, what to do. So that's kind of cool as a community thing. 
like an educational thing. We okay, chat? Yeah, unfortunately, we can see that there are cars. There's someone being pushed in a wheelchair, and this car is just literally in her asshole. Jeez. Stop, drop, and roll. Yeah, you know, stop, drop, and roll. Do they still teach that to kids now? I remember they did when I was young. Stop, drop, and roll. A little local cafe, Cafe Colorado. Shout out to anybody from Colorado. Uh, Nagai says, who is sponsoring you, Corey? I just got an ad for Sugar Book. What? I am not sponsored. Yeah, we do have ads. They pop up every 30 minutes on the stream. Some people get them, some people don't. It's like random, but yeah, it's like a new thing. I think YouTube's pushing uh, ads mid live stream. So if it bothers you, I'm so sorry. Uh, what is this? Ozeki. It's a supermarket. Kind of big, colorful supermarket. Red, white, and blue. <laughs> Cylon, yeah, I know. It's like knowledge. Like, if I was ever to catch fire now, I probably wouldn't remember stop, drop, and roll. Because it's been so long since I learned that. Sherry you used to live in Colorado for a wee bit. A little, little wee bit. Oh, it's a sugar daddy site. Yeah, sugar daddy. I, I need a sugar daddy. Here's more of uh, the mascot here. He's got a weird purple shirt on. Yo, Nick teacher in the house, Anyang. A travel commercial. Yeah, it's interesting, like, because the, the, the commercials are, like, regional, right? Um, oh, uh, this is, uh, looks like a bread shop. And then they also sell uh, katsu sandwiches. Hide katsu. It's kind of like lean pork katsu sandwich. 600 yen. That looks actually really good. Hide katsu, hide, it's all hide katsu. Oh, and roast katsu. You always get commercials. Uh, oh, there's a dog. They show what's her name. Uh, she's a YouTuber in Korea. Uh, Sissel. They show si <laughs> they show Sissel, uh, who's my friend. She's in the, the Grammarly commercials, and I'm like, oh my god. Yeah, I remember when she was like starting out YouTube, and now she's like blown the f up. Did you go to the Thai festival yesterday? Uh, no, I did not. I did not. I, I was avoiding crowded places. Uh, here's more of Ginchan and he's advertising these uh, puff. What is this? Cream puffs? Napona? What is Napona? I don't know Napona. But it looks like there's uh, something here. It's uh, Daifuku. You know, like strawberry daifuku, strawberry mochi. This one has uh, basil and tomato in it. I've never seen this in my life. It looks like it's only for May this month. That's so weird. They do sell it there. Uh, should I try that? I don't know if like the signal is going to cut out while streaming inside. I kind of want to try it because it looks so weird. Oh, hold on one second. I'm trying to see what is the price. Uh, it looks like I can see it. It's 162 yen. Let me get that money out real quick so I'm not like fumbling with my money in front of her. We got to try that. That's like limited time only. Tomato and basil inside of a mochi. That is so weird. All right, I'm gonna hold my phone down lower. If we cut out, just hang tight. Uh, 
ありがとうございます。お願いします。このままで大丈夫ですか。はい、大丈夫です。はい。Alright, we got it. 222 people viewing. Hey, how you guys doing?、Uh, we are in Togoshi Ginza right now. It's、uh, the longest outdoor shopping street in Tokyo as well as the entire Kanto region.、Um, we just got a tomato basil daifuku, which is really weird. We're going to go try this right now.、Um, it's, it's like limited edition, it's only available in May. Signal was decent, nice, nice. Yeah, I kept the camera low so it wasn't like I'm filming the, the cashier's face or you know, like. Anything offensive, but yeah,、um, let's go try this out. There's a train crossing right here. I just noticed、uh, Togoshi Ginza has its own station, which is pretty cool. Yeah, hit that thumbs up, guys. Hit the thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you want to see more Japan content from someone who was born and raised here.、Um, yeah, let me cross over to the shade. Oh, God. <laughs> right as I said, let me cross. It started ding ding ding. Yeah, let me cross over this shade.、Uh, this station looks really cool. Can you see that? The, the, oh god, it is shaking really. That's a software issue, guys. I am so sorry. I don't know what is up with that. Yeah, you can see the, the thing there. Let's wait for the ding ding. Yeah, let's watch the train. I think it's coming from、uh, the left side here. The train's coming from the opposite direction. Let's watch it. This is just a part of. Oh, they're running for it. She has to duck. Yeah. They made it. I'm very curious about this、uh, tomato basil daifuku. I'm holding it in my hand and I'm like, hmm, what's this gonna taste like?、Oh, so this one's arriving now. It's got a green color on it. Hoping it was the Pikachu train. Is that on this line? What line is this? Oh, this train is going to Kamata. It's like south, like down towards Kawasaki. Let's, um, let's post up somewhere around here and、uh, let's eat this thing. There's, there's more of a ginchan. Ginchan on the door right there. Is there like a little side? Let me, let me look at the side street real quick. And that shaking is so.、Oh、God, I'm so sorry. It's, it's, now that I see it, every time it's.、Uh, let me post up on this little、uh, fire extinguisher box. In a lot of neighborhoods in Japan, they will have a public fire extinguisher thing like this.、Um, yeah, let me, let me post this right on top of here. Hey, Kara, how you doing? Yi, good morning.
Okay, there we go. We good? Uh, JT says, Corey phone setting off earthquake messages. What? I don't think that's it. Does that have, mm. yeah, it's, it's definitely a software issue, but I'll, I'll stop talking about it now. Yeah, so this is limited. Uh, tomato, basil, daifuku. It said on the sign it's only available in May. And so we're kind of coming to the end of May. I'm glad we were able to get this. Yo, hey Rand, how you doing? Uh, it's, yee, it's, it's the evening for you? Nice, nice. Uh, do you guys have drinks and snacks as we walk around here? Let me, I'm trying to open this thing. This thing is like kind of difficult. I got like one part of it open. I guess I could just kind of squeeze it up like a push pop. Yeah, let me show this to you because there's actually basil inside of the mochi, the, the mashed rice. Yeah, there. Can you see the bits? So th that's like little pieces of basil inside here. And from Bris uh, Brisbane, how you doing? Good morning. Yeah, old bay goldfish, I would crush that. All right, itadakimasu. I'm trying to smell it. I don't smell basil. Mmm. It doesn't match. <laughs> the basil is very, very subtle, very subtle. Tomato just tastes like tomato juice. So tomato juice and like a sweet mochi rice here. Um, it, it's weird. It's weird. It doesn't seem to go together. I would prefer the strawberry, but at least it's something we could try. Yeah, it's got a juicy tomato in there. I wish there was like cheese. That'd be interesting. Oh God. Uh, if there was like mozzarella cheese or something. That's an interesting face you're making. Yeah, I was like processing like, what does it taste like? It doesn't look like it tastes good. I mean, it's food. Um, it's just not like, yeah, it's like confusing. It was like trying to process like tomato flavor plus the sweet mochi. That's so I was like, what is happening in my mouth? So yeah, anyways, um, yeah, a little bit weird, a little bit weird. At least we got to try it. Yeah, let me try to finish it up here. Yeah, it's, it's, it doesn't go together. I think it's, I think it's just like a gimmick thing. Like they're just like, hey, this sounds like a cool idea. Let's sell it. And then everyone who probably eats it is like, oh yeah, it's uh, mm, not like not bad. <laughs> it's not the best, but it's also not bad. Yeah, too bad it doesn't have um, mozzarella. Yeah, and Jason, that's right. That's probably why it's uh, limited time only. They're like, yeah, not a lot of people are gonna buy this. Or they're gonna buy it just once. Oh, there's a dog. Yeah, what was that, Inu 2, Inu 3? That was the third Inu. Yeah, nice, so no cats. I haven't seen any cats. I'm looking though. Yeah, um, I think if they had more basil, that would have been good. Or if they put like some salt with it, like it was weird. It was, it, Cause the mochi itself is like actually pretty sweet. I think that was the issue. If the mochi wasn't sweet, and it was actually maybe slightly salty or something. Um, and they had more basil. That would, then it would have been like, like pretty good. They're trying to imitate tomato basil pizza. I think that's what it is. So they're just like influenced by the whole tomato basil thing. But uh, let's go ahead and continue. 
We good, chat? We good? All right, let's go. All right, there we go. Yeah, if they had like one leaf, one basil leaf, like a fresh basil leaf in there with the tomato, like, boom, it would have been maybe really good. The fact that I tasted zero basil is, uh, is why it was so disappointing. The Aflac cameo, yeah, Aflac. Yeah, sorry, I, I don't scroll up chat so much if I miss something. Just type it again. Um, let's go back and give her our review. Yeah, we should be like, uh, thank you so much. You were really nice. Thank you for offering this. But I'm going to tell you right now, um, don't sell this ever again. <laughs> Please send, send uh, my review up up the chain to headquarters, tell them uh, it, it was not great. <laughs> uh, tonkatsu Maruya. Yeah, a lot of uh, fried food kind of shops around here. And you can get food right on, uh, right in front. There was a dono and a member. Okay, I don't see any dono. Who was the member? Where's the don't? I don't see any donos. Can, uh, yeah, I'm scrolling. I don't see anything. Can someone tell me who it was? Because uh, there's no... Usually if there's a dono, it'll say like, it'll show the dono amount and nothing. Challenge, if you ever get to six Neko and nine Inu in a single live stream, you got to adopt a kitten or puppy. Ah, that is, uh, ooh. I mean, I, first of all, I can't have any pets in my building. And when you adopt, they will check your rental agreement to make sure that you can have pets. So that's like the, the first huge roadblock right there. Oh, Eric, thank you for becoming a member. Yeah, Eric, hey, welcome to the Moist fam. Thank you, thank you for the support. And thank you, thank you uh, for becoming a Moist fam member. I hope you enjoy the little icon next to your name. It will change over time, the longer you remember. And you have uh, now full access to all the emotes on this channel and uh, some other content. <laughs> uh, Jim and Harriet with the $5. Okay, yeah, thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. I don't know why it doesn't show me. I gotta, I gotta send a little email to the, to the app. Be like, yo, it's all shaky, plus I'm not getting dono alerts. What is up with this? Yeah, so we've walked pretty far. Let me, let me look. Let me zoom in down the street this way. Uh, yes, Dombi, thank you. Yeah, uh, hearts and chat for Eric. Hearts and chat for uh, Jim and Harry. Yeah, so we can see pretty far down. We've walked all that way. Okay, and then... to go down like it just goes down it's 1.3 kilometers long so yeah longest outdoor shopping street like sometimes it'll show the dono and the dono will be on there for like for a very long time but there's like zero dono notification. Um, anyways, thank you. Thank you. I appreciate the help. Yeah, so there is a major road here. Yeah, if I, if I took this road, it would take me to like Nihonbashi, Tokyo Station. Like all the way up there. If I went south this way, I could follow it all the way to Yokohama, like Kawasaki, Kamata. Um, fungus. Hey, what's up, man? I see. I see this notice. See it. Like I see it now on this one. Fungus with the twenty dollars, guys. Hearts and chat for fungus. 
says stopping by to say hi. I hope all is well. Yeah, man, thank you. We miss you around here and in Discord. Hope you're doing well, brother. Yeah, this, this alert works and I can see it. It's there, it's like very clear. Uh, I don't know. Anyways, I wonder what she meant. Who? Who? Why? When? How? Yeah, more, more Togoshi Ginza. Yeah, I think what's unfortunate is that they, they keep this open for cars. Like, they should close it off to cars. I think they do that on the weekends, but like on weekdays, still, there's a lot of people. Like, people are going out and stuff. Yeah, I'm looking around to try to see if there's anything interesting to show you guys. Maybe some more of a Ginchan or even real cats. We need to see like one real cat. Hey, look, speaking of Ginchan. Oh, this looks like it's the Togoshi Ginza Information Center for tourists. Oh, you can get uh, merch. You can get some shirts or like a towel, a plushie doll. Let me just try to see if I can zoom in. Yeah, so you can get some uh, Ginchan merch in there, like an eco bag, t-shirt, some face towels. Is Bunny here? I thought Bunny's working. Yeah, good luck. What's up with the balls though? I don't know, what, what is this? What's the deal with this? Another stamp? I don't see a stamp thing at all here. Which is weird, because you'd think that they would have the stamp there, for sure. Oh, 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 Bunny's here in Japan. Yes, yes, yeah. Bunny, Bunny moved to Japan, um, like, last week. And she is working right now, so unfortunately we won't be able to see her in my uh, stream chats, really. Yeah, lots of little, little shops. Look at this old tobacco shop. This is kind of very nostalgic. Yeah, it's like tiny window. I wish there was a cat in the window or like a Shiba Inu. That'd be kind of cool. But don't smoke. Oh, there's a gacha store here, capsule store. They have a weird little mascot. It's like a frog. Ball color, um, maybe section off area? Yeah, maybe. Like, oh, where are you? I'm in the blue area. Where are you? I'm in the red area. I don't know. Yeah, gotcha store. It's pretty big. Yeah, I, uh, I met up with Bunny already and we hung out. I helped her move her luggage to her house. And uh, then we hung out in Shinjuku for a little bit and I showed her around. Um, hold on, I'm going to veer off the side street here. I see a little tiny, like, Inari shrine. We need to see more shrines, and we need to do a little shrine prayer. And maybe there's some shrine cats. If there's a shrine cat, that'd be kind of cool. What is this? Coffee break. Oh, it's, a, it's like a little cafe right here. But this character... It's kind of creepy. But let's see, we've got this tiny Inari shrine right here. Very cool. It's got a concrete tori gate. There's some kitsune, some foxes. It's a fox with a little baby. Oh, he looks cool. Uh, there's no bell or anything here. No jingle jangles. But let's do a little prayer anyways.
Okay. Here we go, chat. Did a little prayer for y'all. Yeah, there's no bell to jingle. Nothing to rub. It's a little plain Inari shrine, but it's okay. We did a little prayer for y'all. Yeah, let's keep going. Oh, you recently learned Kitsune is fox. You've been saying Inari. Oh, <laughs> yeah, Inari is that the type of those little like little shrines. Um, yeah, lots of just like local businesses, real estate places. Oh, I see another dog. There, Inu number four. Inu number four. Yeah, real estate offices. Uh, we've got a looks like a foot doctor. Yeah, cell phone provider, NTT Docomo. So it's all the kind of just like local stuff. Um, I like this sushi place. He's got the sushi uh, chef's like headband that they wear on their uh, head. Hey, Ben Benny, how you doing? Uh, yeah, I'm feeling a little better. Um, once in a while, I'll have a little cough. But so far during the stream, um, no cough. I like that they drew a picture of him delivering food. They, they say delivery is okay. Hey, follow my obsession, how are you? Yeah, if I look down some of these little side alleys, like it's just quaint little quiet cozy alleys. You got like, you know, people putting their planters and stuff outside. Uh, there is a zaku. Jack, uh, this is a recycle shop, it's like secondhand used goods and stuff. This one seems pretty nice. The one near my house is not good at all. Like this one actually has clothing and stuff too. What is this? It's a Jawa, Ronto in Jawa, 3,300 yen. Some random stuff. There's nail polish, it's like 110 yen. Random accessories, 440 yen. Uh, puff, see you later Puff, bye. Thanks for coming today, have a nice day. Yeah, this is a nice place for just a stroll, you know what I mean? Just stroll, just kind of browse, um, look at some of this uh, sumiko grashi kind of bag. Another purse or handbag or something. There's a bookstore here, Meishokan Books. Do they have consignment shops over in Japan that you know? Ah, uh, I don't know. Not, I mean, I, there probably are. I just, I've never seen them or I, I just don't know about them, you know? I'm sure they have them. It would be weird if they didn't have them. Uh, Disneyland is, yeah, this is the 40th, an uh, 40th anniversary of Disneyland, Tokyo Disneyland. So there's a lot of like uh, 40th anniversary like dolls and other merch at the Disney stores. Are there any pawn shops? Yeah, these are secondhand stores like Zach and uh, like Book Off or um, treasure uh, factory and those kinds of places yeah they they do kind of function as a pawn shop like they'll buy your used stuff used books used clothing whatnot but it's not like very profitable you know what i mean like you're not going to get a lot of money so a lot of people do resell things online like uh, mercati merukari uh, this is uh, kind of an old style like home goods store plus hardware store 
plus kitchenware. So you can get like any kitchen stuff, uh, tools, you know, storage containers, like this kind of stuff. This, this whole vibe is like really old. Oh, here's a, a dango in mochi place. They've got dango. I already had mochi today, so I don't want to have mochi again. <laughs> Just like mochi and mochi. Oh God, too much mochi. Um, this shop is pretty famous. Um, there's one similar to this in Sugamo, but they basically, it's like a, a bar for onigiri. So you can have onigiri made right in front of you at the bar yeah ben benny with the 10 singapore dollars thank you so much guys hearts and chat for ben benny yeah sorry i'm looking around and stuff so sometimes it's hard to see the chat but yeah you can get like lots of different toppings and stuff ikura other types of roe salmon uh tuna and mayo and so the the chefs make it and then you just eat it at this bar, like sitting bar. Uh, you can get it to go too, but it's pretty cool. There's one in Sugamo, or is it Otsuka? Otsuka or Sugamo, that's like really famous. straight at me. I'm just walking in a straight line and they're like, are you going left or right? I'm going in a straight line. You go around me. I'm not going to go around you. Love all the fake food displays. Yeah, they're pretty cool, right, James? Uh, JT, you're seasick now. Yeah, I'm sorry for all the shakiness. Uh, thanks for hanging out. We'll catch you later. Was there, a, was there a hobby off? I, I didn't see. And you're going to take an unpaid leave of absence and just travel Japan for three months? That's a pretty cool goal. A lot of people do that. Yeah, there's this place which actually usually has a line um, this Chinese place, they have a lot of like dumplings and whatnot. But uh, the last time I was here, uh, the lady was so rude to me. Um, so I, ne I will never ever give her my money ever again. <laughs> uh, Smiao, how are you? Says, uh, are there many peeps riding track bikes? What is a track bike? Like, like the, the cycling that go, they go in an arena, like in a circle, like the Olympics. I don't know what a track bike is. Is that a company name? Another pet story. Yep. 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 Uh, back in the clay says almost 138 yen to the dollar now. Really? Still. Uh, here is a um, fried food store. This is uh, pretty well known, pretty famous. You could see it's been on many TV shows. A lot of Japanese celebrities um, have been here. Uh, even Shinzo Abe came here. Yeah, very, very popular place. But they sell like uh, koroke, koroke, menchi katsu. Uh, looks kind of empty right now. Yeah, they also sell oden. So you got, there's some instructions about eating oden. They have it in English if you want. And then they talk about all the stuff. So they, they do have an English menu here. So you can see it fresh right here. It's too hot to eat oden. It's like summertime. Like this would be really nice in the winter. But right now, yeah, uh, I would not want to eat oden in like 27 degrees Celsius weather in May. <laughs> <laughs> mm. 
Yeah, the, uh, the lady who was uh, selling the thing, she's Chinese, so um, anyways, yeah, so she's Chinese and uh, when it was, like, there was a long line and then when it was my turn, I went up and then she's like, uh, what do you want? And I was like, mm, and it, like as soon as I said, mm, because I'm like thinking, you know, because I couldn't see what was in the, in the window thing. So I was like, hmm, like what, what will I pick? Will I get like six pieces or will I get three pieces? So I said, hmm, and as soon as I said, hmm, she was like, get out of here. If you don't know what you want, leave. And I was like, what? Like, I'm, 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 I'm thinking, like, I don't know if I want three or six. And she like told me to leave. And I was like, well, well fuck you. Like, like, I'm not gonna buy anything then. Yeah, it was really, really rude. Uh, we okay, chat? Chat, like the chat scroll thing is, nobody typing? Oh, back in the clay says, uh, LOL at the Yatai by the river in Hakata. I get ramen, beer, and oden in August. Oh my God, that's terrible. That's so hot. Yeah, uh, you know. <laughs> oh, there's a cat, there's a cat. I saw a cat. Did you see it? It ran. Oh, you're just listening? Yeah, uh, where'd it go? Oh, it went in this little alley here. Oh, it's like long gone. I can kind of see it. Oh, it's hard to focus. It's in there. Meow meow. Yeah. Yeah, it, it ran really quickly and then it went down this little, uh, it went into this alley. I wonder if it'll go like to the back side. Is there a way to see it on the back side? Uh, there is a way, but yeah, I'm not gonna go down there. It looks like it's just the back of the restaurant. Uh, yeah, she was like kind of like the soup Nazi. Yeah, it was it was really rude. I was like so pissed, and the way she said it, it was just so absolutely rude. I was like, well, all right then. <laughs> Guess I'm not buying anything from you. Yeah, so we have uh, four cats and one dog. Uh, sorry, uh, four dogs, one cat. Hey, check out this shop. They've got, it's a glasses store, an eyewear store. And you can also buy a doll and t-shirt. More fried food stores here. Fresh meat, that's a, also a butcher shop. Yeah, we're kind of coming up to the end over here, which is actually perfect because uh, we are already at one hour, 39 minutes. So we're like nine minutes over my usual streaming time. He looks so smart, right? Yeah. Yeah, when I, uh, I came here in the winter and um, what was nice about that was they had some people like out here, like just right here, like next to the street and they were selling uh, like hot baked uh, sweet potatoes and stuff. So good, so, so good. Here's a local uh, alcohol store. Like they're doing like Japanese, like Nihonshu and stuff and milk also, he's got milk. In Alhambra, in LA, we had a Chinese food and fish and chips place. The guy was the same, lots of rules, only one tartar sauce per order. If you order to go, you can't eat in. Yeah. Oh, speaking of sweet potatoes, here's like a sweet potato shop. Nagimo, eel sweet potato, weird. And they have some outdoor seating, which is actually nice. Yeah, on the on the weekends and stuff, they will put up this this rolling barrier and they'll put it right in the middle to let people know that uh, cars cannot drive down the street. So yeah, um, weekdays looks like cars can come here. 
Weekends, cars do not come down here. It's just way too crowded on the weekends. Uh, H. Welch says, seriously, time is flying. How are you feeling? This is a lot of walking and talking all at once. Yeah, thank you for your concern. I'm okay, I'm okay. Yeah, um, I do need to take it easy to... Uh, there's another little uh, Inari shrine down here. Let's go take a look at it. We okay, chat? Oh, there's a dog riding her cart. Do you see the dog, the Shiba Inu? Yeah, sorry, we probably effed really hard in that alley. It was like between two buildings. Um, there's Inu number five. It's on that woman's like stroller basket thing. It's a black Shiba Inu and he's just sitting sideways on it. Hard to see from back here, sorry. Okay, uh, five dogs, uh, one cat. Hmm. It's looking like it's a dog day, y'all. Yo, look at these construction workers on these little push scooters. <laughs> That's nice. They just left this construction site right here. They're like, yo, time to ride to the store. Yeah, it's a dog day afternoon. Exactly, Timmy. It just looks funny because a lot of those guys are kind of like, I don't know, there's like this image, like they're kind of hard, you know, like, like they don't mess around, they smoke cigarettes and stuff and drink beer and then they're just like, you know, they can lift heavy things and then they're like, yeah, let's go ride these little scooters. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Uh, it looks like this is the end. We are reaching the very end gate of Togoshi Ginza. The very end. Yeah, just popping wheelies, doing like 360s off of ledges and stuff. Oh my God. I can see inside this restaurant. There's a giant ginchan with a pink ball. That's kind of horrifying. Imagine seeing this at nighttime. Like it's all dark and you're walking around and there's just like this giant cat <laughs> holding a ball in the store. Yeah, what is this? Cafe Italiano. Yeah. Okay, uh, let me go this way just a little bit and then turn around and show you guys where we came from. Yeah, so this is uh, the end the other far end. We walked 1.3 kilometers all the way down through Togoshi Ginza, the longest uh, outdoor shopping street in Tokyo and all of uh, the Kanto area. Yeah, I, I need to fix this shakiness thing. This is such an issue, but yeah, it, it's pretty far. Yeah, so uh, what did you guys think? What did you guys think of the indoor place at Musashi Koyama, at Palm? And uh, what did you think of uh, this place, uh, Togoshi Ginza? Let me just walk with you guys this way a little bit. And then we'll, we'll wrap, uh, we're gonna wrap up the stream in like a few minutes here, guys. I'm just gonna talk to y'all for just like a second and say, uh, and see what you guys thought about it. And then uh, we'll wrap it up. Giant cat, a little drunk, it would be a what the fuck moment. Yeah, yeah, I think if I was like kind of just doing my own thing and then I glanced over and be like, oh my God, I'd like double take and freak out. Um, pretty nice though, right? Yeah, if you guys are ever coming to Tokyo and you want to see it for yourself, um, Musashi Koyama Station. Um, it's only a few stops away from Shibuya um, or Meguro. And uh, on the other side over here, like where I'm at now, it's not so convenient. There's no station like super close. But I think uh, Osaki Station 
on the Yamanote line is the closest one. And it's kind of a walk. So yeah, you're better to go uh, to the Musashi Koyama station to get to this place. But yeah, you guys doing okay? Yeah. Um, I'm glad I didn't like break out into a massive coughing fit during the live stream. Maybe in the beginning I did just a little bit, but um, yeah, uh, it's hot. It's hot. Oh, the sun is beating down. So yeah, um, I just want to say thank you so much to all the, the Moist Fam members and all of you regular viewers. Thank you for hanging out with me here on Monday morning, Monday afternoon in uh, Tokyo. And uh, I'm going to walk to Osaki Station go to Shinagawa and uh, take the rapid train home. Rapid, I can't speak. Rapid train home. Uh, let me see, Costa's World of Music, Memories, Jim and Harriet, they say, a nice stream, Corey. Hope you feel a whole lot better. Thank you, that, that means a lot to me, thank you. Guys, hearts and chat for Jim and Harriet. Um, really appreciate it. You guys are awesome. You guys keep me going. Uh, donos or no donos, it doesn't matter. Like Just the fact that I get to see your names in the chat every week and stuff. It just, I don't know, it, it just means a lot to me. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. And um, let's see, yeah, please subscribe to the channel. I think we're like less than 3,600 or something uh, subscribers away from 100,000 uh, subscribers, which is crazy to think about. So yeah, make sure you subscribe, um, like the video and all that jazz. Yeah, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate oh, it. Is, it is bright. I can't like, starting to get hard to read chat. <laughs> great community. Yeah, great community. Yeah, y'all are just like nice, genuinely great people. Um, one second, I do see something that's really weird here. One second. There's this doll with like a shawl and he's holding uh, Olaf from Frozen. What is this about? Yeah. I don't know. It's at a park. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Jason says, make sure you spread the word about his channel. Uh, this channel. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, anyways, guys, yeah, I am going to head off. I'm going to drink some tea and walk to Osaki Station. I will see you guys in uh, another video or live stream um, coming up soon. So yeah, hang out. Uh, stay tuned. That's what I meant. Stay tuned for that info and stuff on um, the YouTube community tab. That's where I post a lot of stuff. And um, also in my Discord. So yeah, Nani? <sighs> kind of like a, it's strangling Olaf's neck. I don't know. Yeah, what was it doing? Yeah, there was a crab on the pedestal. Sorry, I didn't really show that. Um, there was a crab. Yeah. But uh, yeah, much love from me to y'all. Thank you so much for hanging out. Really appreciate seeing you guys this week. Hope everyone uh, is, you know, having a nice weekend and having a nice start to their week. And I will see you guys next time, okay? Okay. Bye-bye. Otsukare-sama. See you next time. Jane, mata kondo ne. Bye bye. What's got it? See you guys. Bye. Bye. Much love. Much love to the moist fam. Jane. What's got it? Bye bye. See you next time. Bye. Bye.